is NBC Connecticut News at 11. We want to bite into a healthy lifestyle. So that is the theme for March. It's National Nutrition Month. Pat Baird is here from the Connecticut Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics to help us out. Good morning to you, Hi, Pat. I'm thrilled to be here for National Nutrition Month. Now tell us about hashtag NNM. Well, NNM is National Nutrition Month, and the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics designates March as the time for people to take another look at what they're eating and how they can make healthier choices. But today is National Registered Dietitian's Day. And we happen to have someone who knows a little bit about that. So tell us yeah. exactly the importance of uh, getting a consultation on your nutrition from someone who is registered. You know, this is wonderful because every registered dietitian nutritionist is a nutritionist. Okay. Not every nutritionist is a dietitian. Nutrition is a science. It's not an opinion. In order to be an, a registered dietitian or an RDN, you need to follow an academic curriculum, do an internship, meet the guidelines, and then sit an exam, and then continue to take um, a lot of education. All right, so there is a lot to it. And so what I love is you've actually, so at, good point, and you've actually brought three sort of guidelines that you okay. use that we can take away. We always want the takeaway. We okay. want to implement today. So These are get my, us on track. my three <laughs> favorite. Okay, Quick, good, good. easy, okay? Eat more fruits and vegetables. And while this seems oh, a little bit too simple, I've right. heard this before, 75% of Americans do not eat the recommended amount of fruits and vegetables. All right, so what is the recommended amount? I know we hear it all the time, but we, it, we, clearly we, we need to hear it again. at least two and a half cups of vegetables and two cups of fruit. And the magic is... Yes, they have vitamins, minerals, fiber, mm -hmm. and water, but they also contain phytonutrients, plant nutrients actually protect the cells in our body. We find those in color. Okay, so, so we look want for the colorful, go rainbow when you're at the grocery yes. store, right? Okay. Red, yellow, green, white, blue. Looks so pretty all together. Of the, <laughs> and you know what, that's it. We all eat with our eyes, right. so it's wonderful. And keep them on hand, but really, we know that fruits and vegetables protect against cancer, against heart disease. They boost our immune system. Get more. Get more of those. Okay. <laughs> Take away. Get more of these as well, right? Fiber. Fiber. Fiber is really the forgotten nutrient. And the benefits of fiber go from protecting our digestive system and protecting against colon cancer, heart disease. But the other thing that people don't realize about fiber, it keeps us fuller longer. Ooh, now that is so, so guess, important. It, it's then you're not going to be snacking on all those carbs yeah. that we always tend to go to when we think we're hungry and those don't fill us up and then we just keep doing it all day. It's important to help lose weight and to maintain weight. So we're talking about beans, peas, lentils, whole grains, nuts, and seeds oh, to get delicious. that extra fiber. Delicious okay. and easy. Okay, now what's over here? Okay, you know, we always focus on activity, but I want to look at one of the most critical health markers that there is, and that is sleep. Is a health marker. Health marker because hmm. the National Institutes of Health tells us seven to nine hours is the recommended amount of sleep. And you and I were talking about this. We tend to go on that like I need nine. I give me nine, I'll take nine, I'll take ten. <laughs> here's the here's the really fascinating part is that people who get less than seven hours a night tend to way more, have more heart disease, mm. have more respiratory problems, have a lack of focus and concentration. For kids, the number is 10 to 12 hours per night. And so many are not getting it. All right, so prescribing you sleep yes. and some good tips for eating. Pat Bear, thanks so much. National Nutrition Month. You heard it here. Hashtag, Hashtag NNM. Thank you. <laughs> We're coming back after this. <laughs> thanks so much.